Alright, game is starting. Uh, this was... Next pick, Yeah, right? next pick, yeah. This is the next pick, so... Uh, I hope we will do fine here. I think they did quite alright for Japanese courses, Yeah, they so. did well. So... It was very interesting to watch, at least. So I predict uh, them to win this one. Set with the flag, trying to get a little low. Yeah, standard position for defending player. Yeah. Miss Kron Middle, fighting for control of the bridge. Trouble is winning. Nice aim from him. Got the flag, but not for long. Double kill from Xer. He still won it low, so I'm trying to juke him. This jump part. This is D got it. Oh, nice. But Mila and Bill was in time. Just like they knew they got it on the middle. Next is winning the battle for the middle, as I see usually. So it's really hard for the TTU to go across. Well, after all, they have two very good uh, mid players with high accuracies. Yeah. First of all, Pella is helping trouble to push the middle. Yeah, very nice to go. Domination on the middle continues. So all to you at the base. So I'm not really surprised at next uh, map pick. Because this this map usually uh, this map's playstyle suits uh, camping players, for example, Pella or Trouble. Yeah, I Long distance shots from the middle. And getting the position, waiting for enemies to come. Yeah, it's pretty much like this. And as I understand, there is no uh, winner or loser brackets in the players. So only one chance to go further. Nice job by Dizzy with Flak making some good kills. In the flag, but we nobody helped this is deep to grab it. Yeah, amazing flag return from uh, the Polish guys. It's really hard for them to make the way to enemy base, but they're defending pretty well. So they're really like one Vimper trying to rush the base. I would say at the moment, uh, even though the scores don't really show it, but it feels like Next is in a little bit of lead at the moment. They almost managed to cross the flag twice. Yeah, it's all about the middle and the 
because they're winning the middle, they're pushing further away. It's hard to get uh, to the flag, but still, if you're just uh, killing the respawns, still it's possible. But when you uh, go to the mid, it's nobody there from the only uh, supper. So pretty much next in a good position now to be, uh, make uh, the first grab. Just need to continue to push. Okay, they got the middle for some time. Let's see, hold on. Lambert is doing some good job, but still, Phil is winning the trade. Ray is sitting on the enemy base, waiting for the support to help him. Now we came in time. I think there is a round, but it's only Two after the ball is clean. Nice, uh, nice fight from the Vampire. But can he cross the middle area? Can't. Was a nice try though. Yeah. Middle was under control. So if you move a bit further away, maybe it would be possible to make the first grab for him. He's rushing through water. Missing on the defense. Again, next got the middle control and pushing to the base. It's really hard to make the grab now because they're constantly killing the guys on middle and they're responding for the, for the base. Blue flag 
Okay, it's there, good dog. Black, finally. Is it low? Yes. Well, I'm here killing him and putting the flag back. Ten minutes into the map, but next is leading one to zero, and they they are not in hurry. So we can play like this in the end. I think you should think about the. Pushing harder, maybe trying to push in three guys because it's they need at least one grab to make it to overtimes. Vampire is in enemy base, nice frags, getting this D. Joking, but they have like a response for him. In trouble. Put him at the low side of the map. A good attempt from the TU, but still futile. Okay, Vampir got the flag again. He should try to get to go some other way because at the moment with low nothing happens. Maybe again in luck, but now to go to the top. Wait, with the grab. Maybe it's the first flag for the TU. Yeah. It seems like he's home. Okay, they get the first. Now yeah. the game is back to the standard normal gameplay. Yeah, it was several good pushes from the TU. And this made, uh, made the tie score happen. Okay, Vampir got the flag again. He's pretty successful now at flag running. Lately. Okay, nice jump and enemy misses him. Missing on the support. We've got the flag. Pretty much and similar flag run. Cap in like last minute. Yeah, it's pretty similar cap to the first one. Vampir got gone to the top, then jumped uh, to the middle, died, and his teammate got the flag. Very uh, quick turnaround. Yeah. This time it's uh, next who has to push. Yeah. I don't know how next could lose to Frax so quickly. Excellent. I think Vampir should do the same again. Right. Yeah, Vampire for sure has a lot of influence in the enemy base. Yeah, he's lost like 3 minutes. He's very successful. Okay, total domination on middle from next. But can, he, can they do something with flag? Okay, yeah, the question good. is if they can push that all the way into the enemy base. That domination. Yeah. Because it's all nice and happy if you can control the mid, but the question is if you can get the effort's life. Excellent. Five minute warning. Excellent. 
next ship just carving now. It's only like four minutes left to move the cap. And now to you just defending altogether. Well, why? I think only Vampir will go on the offense. To distract the next team and the other will just defend. One behind you. Sir, good boost to the enemy base. Be nice frag from him. Has support from the water, but too slow to deal with. Yeah. Excellent. Good position from next on the top of the enemy base, but still, he okay. was close to grab the flag, but no, not gonna happen. Excel, very low, but way is there. This is D. Good kill as well. Vampire with the flag, but Good he's pressure, hit. but still. Yeah. Oh, Xer missing the spawn kill. <laughs> Three minutes only. Looking pretty bad for uh, yeah, for next. For next. Exactly. But if you remember back to Japanese castles, TU was the, uh, was losing till um, I think the last minute. They managed to tie it up at the last minute. Yeah. And next is, is the a nice. good way to do it. Oh, Big so. fights in the middle. I told you. Yeah. Nice Similar things happening here as in last. Yeah, they were playing a you know, nice pressure for uh, like two minutes. And at the end, it works out for them. Too well. And again, over times. Yep, most definitely it will be again decided by an overtime. Or many overtimes. Yeah. Back to normal. Okay, nice. Nicely done by TU. Vampir is waiting. Controlling the middle again, but still. Not pushing. Sneaky waiting by way. Excellent. 
good to middle control. I'm trying to apply some pressure on the enemies. But missing the shots. Just keep shooting the kills. trying to control the lower middle area in the way. Not all the time. Okay, Vampire got the flag. Nice kill on trouble at the lower. Okay, switching area. back to high. Ma. He was trying to juke but too many of the next uh, respond to the base. Sir, got the flag. We're in low. Nobody's here. Okay, nice one. Oh. Now Venter got the flag. And still killed by Sir. Just respond. Again, it's going back and forth. Just like last time. Yeah. It's, it's, it's amazing to see how these two teams are so on the same level. Vampire with the flag, but not for long. Travel is controlling him from the top. Plug out or commit more forces on the attack. Risk it a bit. Changing skills on the middle. Nothing really happening. Both teams are trying. Yeah. 
Maybe go to the flag. Maybe go to the flag. Maybe now. To be some. Yeah, it's soon time for either of the teams to cap. Yeah. Last map they did it. Come on. I think they did it in the seventh minute of the overtime. Yeah, at the end too. Oh no, no, yeah, the start of the yeah. Because they still Somewhere. had to defend for at least a minute. After, yeah, it was uh, like they got the flag. Yeah, more than a minute even. Okay, wait. We have the support with him, but not for long. Time. Jesus. It's not this, it was more quick. Quicker than this one. Yeah, I think we just broke a record uh, in this cup at least. With the longest overtime. Yeah, 8 extra minutes. It's like in duel. I remember there was a match with uh, around 30 extra minutes. Well, uh, I remember back in the standalone game when Fake Life was uh, in the standalone form, uh, not the Steam game. Uh, they had a different uh, overtime system. And in one of the public games there, managed to get a ridiculous map, somewhat over an hour of overtime. That's some crazy things there. One hour of overtime. I think it was, the map is called Overlord, it's like a huge um, map. Lots of grass. And, uh, yeah, it's pretty annoying to play there. Is big distance. You almost always need to use zoom. Red flag return. But as, it, uh, as I noticed um, after the update, when you can see the um, the settings of the player like fourth and uh, when he's zooming exactly but also, yeah a lot of players are using to the game and also there is a setting that you can also see the buttons that he's pushing at least the straight buttons and probably the jump as well <laughs> nice. because uh, as I noticed a lot of players are using zoom as well and uh, using a low fourth I thought uh, most of players are using some uh, over the hundred fourth and it's not like um, this. Not all of them. Yeah, I was surprised pretty much. But I'm pretty sure that Xer uh, from Team Next is using the max possible fourth setting. That is 130. Because if you switch over to him... He can also he can almost see what's behind his back. 
<laughs> even when he doesn't turn back. <laughs> okay, he has a flag. Fun fact, um, if they manage to get the 6th overtime, no, the 7th overtime, no, after this overtime, uh, it will be pretty much uh, another game, at least uh, the time that they consume for these two overtimes. Yeah. In both matches, they add up to 20 minutes, which is the normal play time for a match. Yeah, and no flag. It's almost still played three maps already, which is very tiring for both of the teams. Very exhausting to play like this. Excellent. Endurance. Kind of unlucky though that they yeah. managed to get the flag in time. But so still, they have to play it's a another ten, uh, two minutes, which gives a little bit of a chance for EU to bring it back. It's not impossible, but it's going to be very, very difficult. Um, honestly, I'm not really seeing it happening right now. So is the champion. <laughs> he got it. Yeah, it should be a pretty much a hero run. To it. Oh, Vampire got it. Pretty much far Almost. away. Yeah, yep. but good that uh, the control over the middle area was on the, the, the next team. There to save the day. Yeah. Okay, there's massive push from TU, of course. Or if not the day, at least the match. Only one minute left. Yeah, finally. Finally, it will be 3 2. two. Finally it's over. <laughs> yeah. It's... I bet it's really tiring for the players as well. Of course, there's, you're starting to make the mistakes. Not a lot of concentration left and such stuff. And at the Missing moment some it shots. seems that they will have to play another at least 40 minutes of gameplay. Yeah. Since it's best of 5. Yeah, it's two maps more in kind. Both minimum. of the teams have one, at least one. Okay, Vampire. Oh. Nah, there's clearly no time anymore. Yeah. It was the last attempt. No, if you go low, you won't have time. Ah, oh, last attempt. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah, GG. Only well, yeah, one flag again, but in next favor this time. Good thing they started in time because it'll take long. 